Hi friends, I'm Sharvari Sani from Electrical Department. Today we are going to solve one problem which is based on the three phase supply. Let us read the problem. Three similar coils connected in star take a total power 1.5 kW at power factor of 0.2 Ligy from three phase 440 volt 50Hz supply. Calculate resistance and inductance of each coil. Now from this coil problem it is very clear that it is a star connection so first of all we will write down whatever be the values which are given to us so it is a star connection the values which are provided to us these are total power which is equal to 1.5 kilowatt so as it is a kilowatt I am multiplying by 10 raised to 3 so for the further calculation it will be easy for it. So it is 1.5 10 raised to 3 watts. Power factor which is given to us which is 0.2 lagging. Now as it is mentioned 0.2 lagging it means that it is nothing but the RF coil or RF circuit which is already mentioned into the problem. Supply voltage which we normally mention by the VL and it is 440 volt frequency given to us which is 50 hertz now these are the given things now what the factors which are supposed to find out these are component that resistance in each phase and the inductance in each phase as it is a star connection first of all we will write the equation for the given power so power is equal to root 3 Vn Il cos theta. Now from this point we will be getting the values that power is equal to 1.5 into 10 raised to 3 which is equal to the root 3. Vn is given 440 volt Il which is supposed to calculate and cos theta which is 0.2. By calculating this part, we will be getting the value of IL which is equal to 1.5 into 10 raised to 3 upon row 3 into 440 volt into 0.2. So IL after this calculation is nothing but 9.84 ampere. As it is a star connection, IL is equal to my IPH and VL is equal to the root 3 times VPH. Now coming back to the question which is asked to us, they are asking us to calculate the value of R and L. It means that if we are able to calculate the value of our impedance per phase, these two values will be de definitely getting from the given equations. So first of all, we will calculate the value of this head. The Z is always represented into the ZPH, which is nothing but equal to VPH upon IPH. Now, as it is a star connection, we already written that V is equal to root 3 times VPH. So, from this equation, we can calculate that VPH is equal to VL upon root 3. VL is already mentioned, which is 440 volt upon root 3. And the value is coming 254.03 volt. This is nothing but my VPH. I already have the VPH now and the value of I is equal to IPH. So IPH is equal to 9.84 ampere. Going back to the same equation, now I can easily calculate the value of ZPH which is equal to VPH upon IPH, so 254.03 upon 9.84. By doing the calculation, we will be getting the value 25.82 ohms. The value which we got in this calculation, it is a magnitude. We can write this equation into the polar form directly by using the value of the cos theta. Now, they have given you the cos theta which is equal to 0.2 and definitely it is a lagging power factor. From that we can calculate the value of theta which is equal to 
0.46 degrees. Now I can write the value of this head pH in the polar form. So it is equal to 25.82 with the angle 78.46. Now this value if we convert into the rectangular form, we will be getting the value as a 5.17 plus J 25.3. As this head pH is nothing but the combination of the resistance and the excel, so the given value or calculated value right now, so R is equal to 5.17 ohms and excel is equal to 25.3. We already put the value of R in this part, but they are asking the value of L. So Writing the equation again that XL is equal to 2 pi FL. So XL is equal to 25.3 2 into pi into frequency which is given as a 50 hertz and L is unknown to us. So the value of L is equal to 25.3 for 2 into pi into 50. After this calculation, we will be getting the value of L is equal to 0 0.08 Henry. So finally, we have the answers with us that the value of resistance is 5.170 ohm and the value of inductance is 0 0.08 Henry. Thank you very much.